Hey, uh, it's Dave. Still the um, beautiful weekend here in San Diego. I'm actually in Alpine. Uh, short video. I uh, the last one I did about my 2021 Indian Challenger. I think I left out a couple little details and I misspoke about some of the specifications of the performance of this amazing machine. Always thank you to Indian Motorcycle of San Diego who got me on this beautiful bike and. They just went above and beyond with customer service and professionalism to make sure that every detail was working properly um, when I uh, got this beautiful bike. So, um, the front of the bike, it's actually an Indian Pathfinder Adaptive Headlight, which I forgot to state. It's got a kind of a halo around it, and both the halo and the Indian headdress on the front fender light up, which is really great. Um, works beautifully to send the light in the direction that the bike is turning. It's a fixed fairing bike, and so it senses how much the bike leans and sends the uh, light in that direction. So that's a huge benefit. I've got this uh, Clockworks flared windscreen. It goes up and down, and it works great. We have the uh, Arlen Ness aftermarket mirrors which I changed out and also the uh, black levers matter uh, blackened out levers it swapped out from the uh, stock uh, aluminum ones so nice blacked out look for the dark horse a couple other little things that uh, were done did a full audio upgrade these are 100 200 watt um, Indian power band uh, audio upgrade speakers and also two more on the uh, top of the saddlebags. Um, added uh, Indian crash bars on the front and toe stops and Indian select floorboards. And I uh, actually changed out the brake uh, peg with a Kiriakin one, which is just a little flatter. The and I did the same on the other side with the shifter so they match. I just like having something flat to hit when I'm changing gears or applying the brake. So, and they they look great. We have the um, oh <laughs> again the 1901 Indian head penny on the gas tank. Little silicon holds that in place. The Rogue seat, stock Rogue seat by Indian, got a matching. Um, rider backrest which works great and then the um this beautiful touring low profile tour pack by indian matches the paint perfectly i love how the hinges are all, are black on this and that indian black indian badging it just just looks great um <clears throat> my brake lights and signal indicators are updated with the uh, custom dynamics lights on the back of the saddlebags and they work great so additional visibility for other people out there on the road this bike has a um, stage one high performance air intake by indian you can see there that there on that side and then uh, we have uh, aftermarket slip-on pipes they're tab performance slip-ons with zombie baffles they are absolutely fantastic for the sound. And lastly, uh, we've got the Stage 2 performance cams installed. It added, uh, it's supposed to add 10% horsepower and 3% torque, which would mean 134 horsepower and over 130 foot-pounds of torque. Believe me, I can feel it when I'm out on the road. If I need to pass somebody, there is no issue getting on it and getting uh, around them. Uh, this bike has Smart Lean technology, which um, basically adjusts the traction control and the braking to factor in the lean, lean angle of the bike. So it just so stable and handles the curves so beautifully. Uh, the GPS is also equipped with um, real-time traffic and weather uh, overlays on the map it's fantastic so 
I think I've got everything this time. I am uh, buzzed out to Alpine for uh, lunch and real pretty ride out here in this neck of the woods. I hope all of you are having a wonderful weekend. And uh, that's it for now. El Guapo out.